Hi, I'm Lynn Fisher from the Federal Housing Finance Agency. Today we released our House Price Index report and data for the fourth quarter of 2020. In the fourth quarter, house prices rose 10.8% from the year prior and 3.8% from the prior quarter, which represents both the largest annual and quarterly gains in the history of the FHFA HPI. These headline numbers are based on our seasonally adjusted purchase only index. Over the last four quarters, house prices rose in all 50 states as well as the District of Columbia. The largest top five gains were in Idaho, Montana, Utah, Arizona, and Connecticut. Four of these states are in the Mountain Division, which had the strongest annual growth among all census divisions, posting a 13.3% year-over-year house price gain. The region has led in annual appreciation for 13 consecutive quarters, as immigration from the West Coast has continued. Records are not only being set by the Mountain Division. At a national level, house prices are climbing faster than ever, following a pause in the second quarter during the onset of COVID. Compared to a year ago, annual gains measured in the fourth quarter nearly doubled. Digging into the monthly data, we see that house prices were appreciating at a relatively constant rate through the first part of the year, and then appreciation began to strengthen starting in July as the economy reopened. In the face of many economic challenges arising from the pandemic, house prices remain a bright spot. A continuation of low interest rates and shortages in the stock of homes available for sale should maintain upward pressure on home prices in the near term. If rates gradually rise later in the year, or if vaccinations begin to change buyer and seller behaviors, the pace of price appreciation could moderate. To read the fourth quarter's report or check out our free data and tools, please visit fhfa.gov forward slash HPI. For FHFA, I'm Lynn Fisher. Thanks for watching.